I am kind of happy that I'm not staying here for the fall just because it feels a bit surgical ward. Bathroom, kitchen, <laughs> and this is it. I, it just upsets me when this doesn't have the, you know, this thing. Everyone always says, you know, I'm in their house when you go into the bathroom and that's done. But I just think it's just so silly, random and goofy. Went and got a Burger King. I finished a week of work. Usually I'd be quite the party animal. Uh, I actually just want a nice long sleep. <laughs> So normally I would carry around that like it's fine it's not that fucking big but it is hefty it has my laptop and stuff I can book it into a place for six euro and I just think it'll probably be the best six euro I ever spent I'd spend that on a coffee like apparently that's where my bag drop is right now I need to look up I was calling it the hill of Nice but my friend was like it's called Cascade so we're gonna try and find that Why didn't I just say I had a boyfriend? Oh bless him, now he's going to be wondering why I'm not texting him back. He goes like this, are you struggling for directions? And I was like, how the fuck would you know? And he goes, well I can tell you the directions. And I went to my fucking Airbnb? No, I'm not telling you where I'm going. I'm moving to my next fucking Airbnb. About a million fucking bags. I did just spend 90 euro on Birkenstocks because I forgot my sandals back in Brighton. However, it'll be a good investment for Asia. Burns pasta is beyond me. How did I even manage that? Okay, I got a bottle of wine and I'm going back up to my apartment now. Okay, and then I need to do my makeup really quickly. This is the quickest get ready with me ever, and I look awful. Which I'm kind of nervous for. I've shown up to these before by myself, but I'm still a little bit nervous because I'm like, what if it's like all massive friendship groups, do you know what I mean? Um, I'm very drunk. It's not even funny. So excited. Jesus Christ, you wouldn't want to bring a boy back. The plan today is to go to Monaco, finish the rest of my book, sit on the beach for a little bit. Then I may be meeting someone at half six. He's six foot five. Okay, bye. <laughs> Monte Carlo is great. It looks so cool. I don't know. I don't really like flashy da da da. I don't know. <laughs> friends vibes but lovely to chat with someone <laughs>
market that is on in Nice on a Monday. Watch me butcher this now. Kusilea. There's no bins at my Airbnb. I met this really kind woman over there. And she let me into her thing. <gasps> I see the market. I'm slightly panicking because I got a message from my manager and I forgot to film videos them and submit them. So that's a bit of a problem. Is this the way I came? Yeah, I think it is. So my train is delayed by 20 minutes. Four, three, two, one. This is probably the cutest thing Airbnb I've ever fucking stayed in. I think I have that all done. Oh, <laughs> you gotta, you gotta take me on a date to have fun with them. We're gonna go find water and uh, put ourselves in there. This was in the bathroom, right? I thought it was a pregnancy test. It's a fucking temperature thing. Well, it tells you a lot about my social life. Blister. Ah, I'm well, well, well. has a little shoebox full of like first aid bring you along on my blister <laughs> i have cleaned the wound oh wait that's fucking tiny ah oh, i need a bigger one wouldn't we all love i do have a dirty sense of humor i really do i don't know where it came from fun fact i went to french college also i won student of the year at it i would describe myself as very like free spirited a bit of a liability now however in school i was a lick arse my arm for like 20 minutes oh fucking I don't have time to be doing this but my eyes are just so puffy mm -hmm. 